ZebraNet Bridge can be used to update printer firmware. You will need to have your printer installed in the ZebraNet Bridge Group Management window with an active connection. Add the printer to the Group Management window. You can skip this step if your printer is already listed there. You can either add a network or local printer. If you want to use a local port, for example a COM, LPT1, or USB, the port cannot be in use by a printer driver or other application. Example, if the port is in use, it will not be listed. Add the firmware file to the resource management window. Right click and copy the ZPL firmware file from where you saved it. And then paste it into the resource management firmware folder. From the resource management window, select the firmware file and then right click and select copy. Right click on the target printer and select paste, send copied file to printers. A warning dialog box will appear. Go ahead and select yes to start the firmware file download to the printer. A task list box appears but does not always show progress. This may take several minutes or longer depending on the connection used. It's very important that you allow the firmware download process to complete before taking any system or printer action. Interrupting the printer during a firmware download could cause unexpected consequences. Allow the printer to reset and print a configuration label. Thanks for watching and be sure to check out other videos on how to use your ZT230 printer. Like and subscribe for more.